Well, organizers with the Express Half Marathon have been raising awareness for local area nonprofits for 10 years now. From pets, low cost spay and neuter to Underdog Express and even the WFIC, Curtis Jackson shows us how impactful this half marathon is each and every year for these organizations. The first Saturday in March every year for the past 10 years, runners have been lining up at Memorial Stadium and all for a great cause. There has been a growth. Uh, I'd love to break 400. Uh, it's, if I just keep pushing, I think it will, but we average about 350 to 400 every year. And with three different categories to race in, ranging from 27 to nearly $70 per person, race director Michael Brown says that money can provide a lot of support for these area nonprofits that rely on the community for help. Even with your registration to walk, you're still saving the life of a dog and improving the life of a kid through communities and schools. So it's a win win for everybody locally, and it's just a good event, and everybody has a good time. And with two runners blowing away the old record for the men's and women's divisions, Brown is offering something new in hopes to recruit more runners for this 10th annual event. We're offering a $200 prize for anybody that can come in first place and beat it. And the men's as well, Larry Filer came in at a 111, just killed it. And we're offering a $200 prize for anybody that can come in first and beat his as well. Good luck. And Brown says regardless of the weather, rain, sleet, or shine, they'll have a finish line. Curtis Jackson, KFDX 3 News. Well, that $200 is definitely an incentive. Brown says you can register all the way up until the morning of the race. And for any educators out there looking to participate, each category will only cost you $22. If you're interested in participating in the 10th Annual Express Half Marathon, we're going to have all the information you need to sign up inside this story on TexomasHomePage.com.